What's wrong with having a lot of stuff? Before immersing into the depths of a minimalist lifestyle, Fumio Sasaki tells several stories about people who transformed their lives by disposing of things they used to consider paramount. Most of them had too many belongings piled up in their apartments for years. But after becoming minimalists, they kept essentials to a minimum. Quite often, that's all they needed. But how do they feel about their minimalist lifestyle? The answer can surprise you. They start seeing themselves more clearly by getting rid of things. In the beginning, being happy with minimal belongings is mind-blowing because many people are programmed to evaluate each other by the solidity of their wealth. 